Report, ye swab. Have you found any... What the devil? Hi, Commodore. By the Captain Jane Starlin. She's been sent to spy on me. Cleaver and twin. What the blazes? Scratchraw, she's crossed over. She's a bloody ghost. A ravishing ghost in that. <laughs> Cut that, that out. out! I have to admit I'm a wee bit curious as to how you got to be a ghost, but I'm too busy for that at the moment, so as not to put too fine a point on it, Starlin. Shove off! I have no time for the likes of you. What exactly are you doing? The vast! It'd be none of your flogging business. Aye, well I have a business proposition for you. I kinda need your help. My help? My help? She's having a laugh on a scratch roll. That's what she is. What in the nine layers of heck makes you think I'm ever, ever going to help you after what you and your King Flint did to me and my crew back in Port Dustain? You took me plunder, burned me best ships, drove off me crew, and, and, and... Your parts? She stole your parts, Captain! <laughs> That's right. You stole me pantaloons while I was, uh, <clears throat> entertaining the talented young wenches at the sturdy rapier. If I hadn't been cursed soon after, I swear you and your golden boy king... <sighs> Flint would be playing cards with Davy Jones down in the Johnny Depths. The briny depths? What do I say? The Johnny Depths, sir. Aye, the briny depths. What the blazes is the Johnny Depths? No matter. You'll be down there. Drowned! Dead drowned! With crabs scurrying out your mouth and barnacles crawling up your... Yuck. I get the picture. So, you won't help me then? I'd rather eat my own gangrene, pus-filled, worm-riddled, hang-nail-having, putrid-smelling foot before I ever help the likes of you, or your king. <laughs> But it involves attacking Admiral Cesaire. The entire Azurbian knows you two hate each other. Wouldn't you love a chance to get back at him? I would, and I will, but all in good time. I have other fish to fry. Now be gone, wench. I have business to attend to, and I can't be doing it with you here in the room. Need me privacy. Sorry for not talking during that whole cutscene. I didn't feel like there was a good place for me to just cut in, so... I better not. He may get mad if I mess with his stuff. And I don't know what help they would be anyway. Some old pirate with a huge stash. A rotten old portrait. It's valuable, but I'd rather get my hands on Flint. Only way to make things right, uh, between Flint and Kate. Yeah, that's what I meant. <sighs> Good recovery, Jane. Who are you fooling? From here, I can see the rest of the ruined port. You know, all this place really needs is a few coats of paint, and it would be like the hurricane never happened. Not sure what I'd do with a chandelier. And even so, I can't reach it. Let's see. The floor is rotting away here. I think I can spy the cellar. I'm busy enough with the job I have. Grimjaw's men have searched it. It's the bust of Madame Duisigny. <laughs> what a sourpuss. You'd think a woman would smile if she was getting carved in marble. It's the bust of Monsieur Duisigny. Hmm, <laughs> not a very impressive bust. I have a better one. At home. I'm not really into touching busts. That's Commodore Grimjaw. 
You can tell by his, well, his enormous and very green jaw. I don't need to hook that. That doesn't need harpooning. The net's pretty torn. It's not much good. I like what you're thinking, but I don't have a reason to do that. Okay. Can't reach. I need to think this through again. Okay, I'll come back here. Up to the balcony. This might be Peninsula. Uh, can we take a break? We're exhausted. Um, yes, sir. Okay. Aye, Scullet. Being a swashbuckler makes me pretty much an authority on chandeliers, and this one I can tell is a good, solid, sturdy one. God knows you don't want to swing into a fight on a fragile one. That symbol be north. Five letters. Arr. I'd love to drop this thing on Grimjaw's head, but without a brain to knock unconscious, I'm pretty sure it would just rile him up. Hmm. Back to work! I like what you're thinking, but I don't have a reason to do that. Good reason first. Oh, come on. I could use a drink, but they're empty and broken. Who built a wine cellar in a swamp? There's a crevice. It appears someone, possibly Grimjaw's men, searched this crevice already. It looks pretty empty. Nothing in there except possibly infectious diseases. If there was anything of worse, it's gone now. It is what it seems. What do you think it is? Look within yourself for the answer. What do you think it is? No clue. Why do you keep asking me? You figure it out yourself. Papa's working. Hmm. I need to figure out I need to figure out how I can accelerate events. It is an old swamp shack that seems to have misplaced its banjo player. What you looking at, amigos? Nothing, maggoty wench. Oh, tell her about the map! Oh! Yoink. Whip. Boing. A map? Where are we going? Nowhere, she snake. He can't decode it. Oops. Who made the map? Let me tell her about Red Trump. Arr. 
So this was Red Rum's mansion? No, tis a fine hotel. They just ransack it to make pirates feel welcome. Where did Red go, anyway? To heck! <gasps> Dios mio! I just wet myself! Nice trick without a bladder. How'd you get the map? The hurricane uncovered a buried chest. Devasti, Jane be the mistress of spies. Oh, really, mistress? Ha <laughs> ha! Grim. Thanks. I can't stop staring at your terrific smile. I almost believe you. You're into, uh, cursed pirates, are you? Mate, I are a ghost pirate. <gasps> she has to join our crew. She's a spy. Who ain't? Most girls run screaming from us. They're just rushing home to change into something sexier. Oh, I wish I'd known that. You guys be legend. Do you like us more than Flint? <laughs> uh, sure. <laughs> I want to join your crew. Welcome aboard! Nah, you only be half ghost. I can tell. Why do you keep hitting him like a piñata? What? Like this? See? He loves it. You're not folding that right. Let me. I are the scourge of the Western Seas, you know. Someday you'll let me join. I need you to get me to Grand Fasil. What be me reward? You need letters of pardon. Ha! We're pirates forever! I know where the treasure is. It's not treasure, it's a ship! Blast ya! She didn't know that! How fast can she sail? She doesn't sail, she flies! Oh! Say anything? Aye, me bad. Right. What's she called again? The, um. The Flying Deutschman. Button hatch, you boneheaded wool weasel. I forget. What's on that ship? The skulls of nosy little girls. I'll be your friend. I prefer to buy me friends. What do you want more than anything in the world? I'll give it to you. A little quiet so I can work! Ooh, ask me! Ask me! Gracias, Grim. Best not. Grimjaw's sure to spy me. We can do it. The floor is rotting away here. Got. We're gonna set up a little shenanigan. Just one shenanigan, but it has two parts. First part is to kick that those beams. No, not look at. It's a timber beam. Probably from one of the rotting ships on the bayou. Wow! It worked! Okay, so now... That's part one. And now... I'm gonna go to the balcony. We're gonna have some fun with the skeleton's, uh, business associate. Captain! Why don't you ask your books for help, college boy? <laughs> They've got my pelvis!
comer. Oh! Shh. Play dead! <laughs> Or dead already! I'd better leave it here for now. Oh, no! I'll need that! Good idea, but how do I attach it? The netting will help me tie the harpoon to something. Yay! The harpoon and netting will easily tie onto the bottom of the chandelier. Time for hijinks. Now who's a big dangerous chandelier? Get up! Now find Jane Starlin's body! It's somewheres nearby! Uh-oh. Wait for it. Oh, wait a minute. What am I doing? We're gonna steal that map. You ready for fun? Yeah. Uno, dos, tres. Off she goes. I guess I just use it on the open water. Mayhaps later. It's the map I stole from Grimjaw. Hey guys! I got Grimjaw's map, but it's in really ancient Astiglan. It describes an island in a demonic skull with long hair. It belongs to Red Rum. Oh, he was the lamest pirate ever. Oh, his ship was always getting spanked by the Colonial Navy. That's how he got the name. He disappeared searching for an island called Skullet Rock. The map is useless without a larger context. The island could be anywhere. These Aztecland glyphs match the mosaic in the Emperor's throne room. Now it is clear. Skullet Rock is due southeast of Vuju Island. Okay. It is a gateway to the underworld, where Aztecland sacrificed gold to the Lord of Darkness. Or as you pirates call him, Old Roger, ruler of Heck. Old Roger? I didn't know that. I'm not, I guess I'm not up on my pirate lore. Yeah! <laughs> that was fun. All right. Wow. There's a lot of stuff here. This is the looting portion of the game. This, so I can return it to its owner. <laughs> yeah. I don't like that vintage, but I could use the core. Someday I'll come back and loot you, but I'm on a mission something in there what's it say shoot I can speak Astiglan but I can't read it what's up although you got a friend 
Papa Doc, can you translate? Kilbaba, an obsessive Aztecan demoness, met Old Raja at an underworld conference and fell in love. Old Raja is the lord of the underworld. Yes, I knew that. They dated a while until Raja felt it <coughs> got weird and tried to break it off. Jerk. Kilbaba was quite persistent and uh, would not leave Roger alone. And caught and boiled Roger's pet rabbit. Huh. So Roger built Scullet Rock, where you are now, over the entrance to Heck, and sunk it underwater so Chilbaba could never find him. I was with her till the rabbit part. Well, all women are crazy, in some way. Ah, I know you're busy, but can you get me in contact with Chilbaba? I need some firepower. Why would a demoness help you? I know the location of Scarlet Rock. Ah, thus she could find old Roger again. You need a clean mirror, candles, and chalk to make a scrying device. Hmm. Well, there are some candles. Don't need it right now, but fire is always handy. There's a mirror. It needs cleaning, but with what? With cleansing fire. Something's not working. I can't reach Chilbaba. Do you have your chalk? I need to think this through again. It's a golden bowl. I love the pattern. Yeah, let's take those bed sheets. We can use the bed sheets to clean it. A stick lung cotton. One thousand thread count. I'll be using you later. No luck. There's no soap here. Do you have your chalk? It's a painting of cute too. sailors. Ay, Dios mío! They're staring at me. That seems like it'll be important at some point. Very well, but last time I got drunk, I lost Flint forever. Okay, let's go to the ship. Hard to starboard! It's one of two terrifying dragon heads with cute pink mouths. I'll reach down your throat and wrap your tongues around your snouts. You gotta be tough with scary pink dragon heads. There's a bucket. I'll grab it if I need it. I'm not lugging it around. Make all sail, you sea dogs! I hope it isn't full of demonic lemurs. I don't want to touch it unless I really need to. On more! There's nothing inside but slithering, starving intestines. What? I lost! All it's rusted shot. The ship's trapped. My men, my men. Ah. Oh. Guten Abend. 
Captain Redrum? Where is that? Captain James Starling! Permission to board? Verboten! No women! Bad luck! Seriously, how much worse can it get for you? Yeah, have to admit you got me there. Come aboard, then. Captain, where's your crew? He tricks you. Web of lies. What happened here? I lost. I lost. Can you leave the wheel? Nine. I must outrun the storm. Who did this to you? Roger. The bargain. Don't trust him, Fräulein Starling. He lies. How did Roger do this? You're working for him! You won't get my ship! What exactly was the bargain? His man of war for my soul and my crews. But he tricked us! How? The ship's trapped. My men, my men. Ah! Oh. How did you get your men to sign? They swore a blutschwer. A blood oath to me. So I represent them. <laughs> You're pretty tricky yourself. Why did you need the ship? I always wanted to be a rump-kicking pirate, not the one getting the rump kicked. If I free you and your crew, can I take your ship? She's cursed! You must not! You go mad! It's fine. The guy I'm giving it to is nuts already. I'll try to save your men. My God, they must hate me. Yeah, they probably do. But it's never too late to put things right. Why can't you just fly out of here? I was tricked. I got the ship I wanted, but I can't find the way out of heck. What's Roger's weakness? Nothing. He's a paperwork master. Don't sign anything. To trap you mit fine print. Well, I'm pretty sneaky. I'm sure I can come up with something. I have to reach Katro Kate. Who? This girl who's going to marry the only man I ever loved. It's complicated. I found this Astiklan scroll. Help me fathom it. Jilbaba loves Roger. Even though he ditched her. So, she'll help you. Ah, for the chance to see her true love once more. Auf Wiedersehen! Hmm. Hard to starboard! Maybe now she'll touch that barrel? All hands to stations! I don't want to touch it unless I really need to. Okay. Fetch that hook up! What's slowing us? This is the devil's own galley. I'm not touching any more than I have to. Plus, that looks kind of sharp. Mikkel! It's full of blood! No, just kidding. It's full of spiders. No, get a hold of yourself. It's empty. You kidder. It's the waterfall that's pouring out of the cave I fell through. It's very pretty, if you like pretty things. I can't do that from here. Yeah, fine.
Bluebelly said rainwater. That's too salty. Ready? Hey, how do I clean a tarnished mirror? Hmm, that'll only come off with soap and rags. There's no soap here. Make your own. Combine animal fat and lye in a bowl. There's no animals here. There's no lye. Get lye from the ashes of hard wood. Combine the ash with rainwater in a barrel and let it sit. Ah, Bluebelly, you should have taken this mission. I'll take your mom on a mission. <laughs> Guys are all loco crazy. This might be the what rain will fall. Bueno. I'll grab it if I need it. I'm not lugging it around. Nay, but good idea. Ow. If I sat down now, I'd never get up. Ah, I was hoping that would work too. How do I, I clean need to get a that tarnished in, mirror? Info again. Hmm. Like That'll wood. only come off with soap and rags. There's no soap here. Make your own. Combine animal fat and lye in a bowl. There's no animals here. There's no lye. Get lye from the ashes of hard wood. Hard combine wood. the ash with rainwater in a barrel and let it sit. Ah, Bluebelly, you should have taken this mission. I'll take your mom on a mission. <laughs> Guys are all loco crazy. Sorry, no use. Uh, that would have been fun, but no. Come on, work! Shoot. No, but it was a long shot. Nay, but good idea. There has to be something at a one Nay, on. but good idea. Nay, but good idea. Nay, but good idea. Make all sell, you sea dogs! Haste! Spread quick! Nay, but good idea. Nay, but good idea. On board! There we go. I better stick with the recipe. Blue said ash and rainwater. The barrel needs a stopper or everything will run out. To starboard. All hands to stations. Got it. Fetch that hook up. What's slowing us? That's enough water. Make all sail, you sea dogs! Mouse turned off for a second, jeez. Haste! Spread quick! I better stick with the recipe. Blue said ash and rainwater. On more! Nay, but good idea. I'll go get it. 
The ship's trapped. My men, my men. Oh. I better stick with the recipe. Blue said ash and rainwater. All hands to stations! Nay, but good idea. Fetch that hook up! I need to think this through again. Nay, but good idea. Nay, but good idea. Mikol sell you sea dogs! Sorry, no use. Haste! Spread! Sorry, no use. On board! Mayhaps later. They're made of tallow. You know what tallow is, right? Sure, of course. Tallow? What are you bothering me for? I'm busy. You figure it out yourself. Papa's working. I know this. I know this one. Just wait. Hang on. I'm going to look it up. Stay right there. All hands to stations! There, there's probably an inventory item I still need. Well, we'll figure it out on the next episode of The Ghost Pirates. So grab a snack and we'll be right back.